Hi guys, welcome to our channel. Can you guys tell where we are right now? We're at the Yunnan. We are at the Yunnan Garden located near NTU. Yunnan Garden is a beautiful park within the university campus, and we think that it's worth checking out. So let's get started. So we are walking in right now. First of all, the right here. It's like passing by so many NTU campuses and all that. I didn't know NTU was that big. You can take bus 179 from Bonne Interchange. On the way to Yunnan Garden, you can see the university campus. And as you can see, there are pagodas here. So it's very like Chinese, China vibe, you know? So if you guys not watch our China series when we went to different cities in China, go check it out. Look at this, there are many different pagodas. With that, with that, oh my god, wait, wait a second, wait a second. There is this water cooler. This is like the water cooler that I have in my school. These China vibes came about because of the history here. So this part was built in 1955, the same time when Nanyang University, or in short, Nanta was built. Nanta was the first Chinese university in Singapore. The building here used to be the administration building for the university, but now has turned into the Chinese Heritage Center, a museum that shows the heritage and culture of Chinese. On the slope, you can see the giant words, which represent the spirit of this university, self-improvement and strive to advance. Wow! However, in 1991, the original university was closed. This was replaced by a new university called Nanyang Technological University, or NTU, which remains to this day. Today, NTU is not only one of the top-ranking universities in the world, it's also one of the most beautiful. You can easily spot the elements like stone carvings, flowers, pavilions, and shrooms. These are the main features of a traditional Chinese garden. The garden is so big, and we didn't realize there are two levels. On the lower level, you can find the garden and this waterfall. And on the upper level, you can find the lake. The Nanyang Lake is now bigger, but what's impressive is that the water here comes from a series of cascades that have been filtered from underwater stuff. See? Fish and turtle live happily here. We love walking on these boardwalks to enjoy the view of the lake. There are 1,000 new trees with 80 other species. There are many walking trails here, each with a different theme. We're so excited to see the herbs. Although we eat them all the time, we don't quite know how they look on the ground. And if you're lucky, you can discover some hidden signs. There's even the National Flower Singapore, Venda Miss Jokum. Look how gorgeous it is. And they even have Wi-Fi connectivity around the whole garden too. Not only students use them, but the public can too. There are not many places for you to eat at Yunnan Garden, but there is a food court at the other end of Nanyang Lake called Food Paradise. Though there isn't much to do at Yunnan Garden, there are plenty of spots to take some worldly Instagrammable shots. It's also a great place to go for a walk. We heard that it looks amazing at night. For the students, they can take a break from all the work. Yunnan Garden is not only a beautiful park, but it has a significant past and a great future too. See you guys next time, bring you guys travel again! Bye! Bye.